delete these apps from your phone and then your phone will stop misbehaving or hanging these are the apps where junk uh, files are stored and most of the people that use iphone and android doesn't know where these junk files are stored and they will, your phone will keep hanging so in this video i'm going to be teaching you how to locate these junk files and delete them so that your phone will be free forever so we are going to be starting with the android then from the android we move over to the iphone okay now for the android what you first of all do is you go to your apps and look for file you can look for file of in some phone they call it file manager why some phone they call it uh, my file okay in samsung this is a samsung phone they call it my file immediately you enter my file the first thing you have to do for me is to you go to your storage okay well let's go to recycle bin recycle bin is a place where everything you have deleted where it stores okay so you go to recycle bin you will discover everything you have deleted so far these are the things you have deleted so far okay and they are stored here you won't even know that they are stored here so and these are one of the reasons your phone has been hanging all this while because most of these things you deleted you feel you have deleted it from your phone but it is still there in the recycle bin so another important of this recycle bin is that if you have anything that you mistakenly deleted or maybe somebody went to your phone and deleted a file you can see them in this recycle bin okay so but in this video we are just talking about how to free your phone from hanging so what you have to do is what you click on this edit you click on edit and then you select all or you go through them one after the other to see the ones you want to delete and the ones you want to restore if you want to restore it back to your phone you click on this restore if you want to delete them so that it will be permanently deleted from your phone so that your phone will be free from hanging and from misbehaving and then you have more space to accumulate new files so you click on this delete you delete all so you see i have over 500 and something 573 uh, uh files that i've already deleted i felt that they are already gone from my phone but i didn't know that it was stored in the recycle bin so now that is the first thing you do so the second thing you have to do for me is on this same my file or file manager okay you go to internal memory if you go to internal memory display the root essentials you click on this essentials and select all so that you can be able to see all folders okay now immediately you select all the next thing you go is click on android if you click on android you click on media or you can click on data or okay let's go to media first if you click on media the next thing you do for me you look for whatsapp look at whatsapp here this is whatsapp you click on whatsapp then you click on whatsapp again then click on media again okay then you click on uh, audio let's talk about let's talk about audio first now in audio this you look at you click on send i don't have any file here this is where all the audio you sent are stored so the next thing you do is you go to uh pictures you go to images whatsapp images you click on send now this is a this is a folder where all the uh, images you have sent to someone on whatsapp are equally duplicated after sending it to the person they will duplicate it again and be uh, uh, occupying some memories for you so you have to delete them because you already have them on your phone just that whenever you send it to anybody it will duplicate so what you have to do for me is you click and hold it then click on all select all then you delete it from your phone now as you're deleting it don't forget it is entering back to that your recycle bin so after deleting it here we have to go back to the recycle bin again to delete them so it is moving to the recycle bin it's already moved to the recycle bin so the next thing you do for me is you go to videos you click on whatsapp video you click on sent whatsapp video now these are the videos you have sent to people for me i just have two videos for you you will see that you have as many as you can so you click all to select everything then you delete them don't forget that they are not permanently deleted from your phone they are moving direct to your uh to your recycle bin so if you want to move if you want to delete them permanently from your phone you have to go back to the recycle bin and delete them permanently so that is that for whatsapp you can do the same thing for for uh your telegram and any other app that you send a video or pictures for people so that is that if you have whatsapp uh business whatsapp 
you can do the same thing as well for business whatsapp so that is the second thing you have to do to free up space from your phone so that your phone will stop hanging all right so the next thing you are going to do for me is you go over to your setting you come to your setting once the setting opens you go to apps you go to your apps look at it apps you click on apps okay please as you're waiting for it to load please don't forget to like share and subscribe for everything concerning tech problem your phone problem your laptop problem and your ipad problem any device problem will be solving it in this channel so click the like button and then subscribe to the channel all right okay now once it opens the next thing you're going to do for me is now there are some apps in fact most of the apps here what you do is anyone that consumes more space anyone you can sort it here you click on this place okay then you filter it by size you sort by size you you say okay okay now the app that uses the main size okay let's see again show system app you can show all of them click on show system app make sure that the filter is on all then you you sort it by size so that you will know the app that is consuming more space okay so now the first app that is consuming more space here is the media peak the media picker so that's the first one okay so look at the storage it consumes 1.54 gig so if you click on that that place then the next thing you do for me is to clear this uh, this catch. Click on this catch, or you come here self and, and clear it. Click on this one, clear catch by the side. But in this app, this is an app that the system comes with, so it doesn't clear. So the one you are going to clear is the app that you download, any downloaded app. Okay, for example, this audio mark is occupying 1.3 uh, 1.30 gig. So if you click on it. The next thing you do is um you click on you click on uh, the storage if you click on storage now you don't clear data just clear this uh, this catch it cleared okay now if you click on clear data here it will delete uh everything you downloaded you know that this is a, a, a music app so all the music you downloaded will be cleared so just just be clearing this one but if for whatsapp for whatsapp <clears throat> my whatsapp business is another one that is uh, occupying space for me so what i do is uh, if you open on it you go to storage then you do the same thing again you clear this now if you click on this clear data if you click on clear data that means you're going to log in the the whatsapp again because it's going to start afresh okay it will delete everything in the whatsapp and start afresh so if you really if you want to start afresh you can just click on it and then it will clear so many things both the wanted and the unwanted uh -huh. then you start afresh if you know that there is no something serious that you stored on your whatsapp so that is exactly how to uh, clear your phone from any problem like clearing the space for it not to hang that is for uh android so let's go to, over to iphone now for iphone the first thing you do is you come to settings once you come to setting no okay the first thing you do is you go to image you go to this this app here let me find the name this photos you go to photos if you click on photos now the next thing you are going to do for me is you go down you scroll to the bottom you come to this deleted uh, recently deleted because most of the things you did maybe you are shooting something you snap a picture and then you selected all the ones you don't like okay you selected all of them and then you deleted them now when you delete them they are not deleting totally from your phone they will come to this recently deleted so you have to come to recently deleted then put in your password you can put in your password so once you put in your password these are your recently deleted apps you can uh, click select and then click on this little button there you will see whether you want to restore it back to your phone 
or you want to delete them all if you want to delete them all you press delete all and then they will clear so one good thing about this is that if somebody go to your phone and delete and it maybe the person shot uh, uh a, 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 a made a video or a picture and delete it the person for the person's mind the person will be thinking that he or she has deleted it not knowing that it will be in the recently deleted so you can go there and check out those pictures the person snapped and know what exactly the person did with your phone now another thing that occupies space is some document that are duplicated so if you look at this duplicating you click on duplicate if it opens then what you have to do for us is to select all of them if you select all of them what you do now is to merge it you see where they wrote merge or you delete them okay or you select just one you see that they are double they are double you see all of them that they are double what you do is you delete one or two and then leave just one or you just merge them you can decide to merge them if you merge them merge extra copy so you merge it so once you merge it or you just delete one of them to free some space on your iphone that is the most important place to free space on iphone so the next thing and the last thing i'm going to teach you on freeing your space is you go to setting for iphone if you go to setting you go to general if you come to general you will see iphone storage you click on iphone storage if you click on iphone storage now you will not see the app that are occupying space on your iphone like my photos is occupying 96.93.86 gig while my snapchat is occupying 15.25 gig so any one of them now if you click on any of them what you do is to offload the app don't delete the app offload it if you click on offload the app it's going to offload so many data and it will give you space on your iphone so thank you very much for watching this video if you have any any other means to uh, offload your iphone or your android please drop it for us on the comment section so that other people will learn from that so thank you bye bye May the peace of the Lord be with you. Don't forget to share this video to your friends.